Monumental announcement for Nevada today, literally. President Obama designated the Basin and Range National Monument. A sprawling desert and mountain area is a classic western landscape that includes rock art dating back 4,000 years. The protected area serves as an irreplaceable resource for archaeologists, excuse me, historians, and ecologists. The monument will protect more than 700,000 acres of public land that's less than two hours from Las Vegas. Vegas. Two other large tracts of wilderness were dedicated in California and Texas. President Obama explained why the wilderness protection is important to him. One of the you know, great legacies of uh, this incredible country of ours is our national parks and national monuments. Uh, it is something that we pass on from generation to generation, not only preserving the incredible beauty uh, of the but also uh, reminding us of uh, the richness of its history. The Sierra Club, the National Wildlife Foundation, and the Las Vegas Metro Chamber of Commerce expressed their support today. Senator Harry Reid issued a statement saying there's an obligation to preserve these lands, and what was accomplished today will last for generations. Not everyone was thrilled with the designation, however, or at least the way it went down. Congressman Crescent Hardy derided it as cronyism between Senator Reid and President Obama. He issued this statement saying, in part, I'm disappointed it for the Nevadans who were left out of the process, including the commissioners of both counties affected, Lincoln and Nye. Hardy feels land use activities should have as much local input as possible. Governor Brian Sandoval expressed similar sentiments, writing, while we all share a common goal of preserving our lands for the use and enjoyment of generations to come, I would have preferred a more collaborative process when making such an important